comparison. The years have come and gone to think we'd be standing here today, arms out, hands clasped. Seven years ago, I never would have foreseen such a beautiful woman. Seven years ago, the boy you met with his socks inside out, the one to see standing in front of you today. It's just funny how things turn out because what a glamorous first impression. <laughs> and I'll still never forget the first thing you ever said to me was you questioned me on what I was wearing. <laughs> but with every first impression comes a new beginning, a new adventure to embark on, a new future ahead. With that, I bow to you first and to be there for you, thick and thin. You have shown me your unwavering love, consent, constant support, and silent strength throughout our years together. And we have faced obstacles that have helped us build a strong foundation. From the love and friendship we have built and all the hardships we have endured, I can wholeheartedly say that you are my soulmate the one I choose to sprint, spend forever with. I vow to love you unconditionally until death do us part, and to never shy away when you are feeling down. I vow to show you the same support you have shown me all these years, and I vow to make a lasting first impression as your new husband and your forever partner. I'm gonna you right now, I can't. <laughs> younger, I would write in my prayer journals every day about what I would want my future husband to be like. But little did I know God would not only answer my prayers, but give me someone who's better than I could ever imagine. And that someone was an 18 year old boy that I met seven years ago on a breezy summer evening in June. A boy who had long greasy baseball hair, wore a neon green Indiana beach, and socks that were inside out. <laughs> A boy I would spend every day for the next two summers with. A boy who I, who I would soon chase after and fall in love with. That boy I fell in love with all those years ago is now a man that I'm standing in front of today on our five year anniversary. It's you, and it always will be you. Derek, you have been my best friend, my comforter, and my home. And now you're my husband. My whole heart belongs to you. And there can never be anyone else I can so joyfully say that to. You encourage me and you love me unconditionally. You inspire me daily to become the best version of myself. You never fail to make sure that I stay positive through anything in life and to never let the clouds roll over my head. As your bride and your best friend, I vow to always stay true to you, respect you, and love you no matter what life throws at us. I promise to admire you and appreciate you for who you are, as well as the man you continue to become. I promise to always travel the world with you and experience new things with you. I vow to take care of you and love you through thick and thin. And most importantly, I vow to always stay sunny and yellow, bright and shiny and cold. And <laughs> God only knew that was once just a summer fling would eventually be turned into eternity. And I thank him every day for the sweet, incredible, unfailing love that I have been waiting for my entire life. Good things come to those who wait it has never felt more true. And I am overjoyed to start this new journey with you. And of course, Ginger. <laughs> now and forever, we make it so easy to say I do. And I love you.
Bay now is to the Bronx. <laughs>